Around five years ago, I made an escape room and built a boat for treasure and invited a lot of YouTubers. This is the video and the compilation of all the videos, in fact, eight. And here's all the rules so you can read them. I hope you comment your favorite part and make sure to subscribe. Have a wonderful time and enjoy the video. Okay, guys, today we're going to be doing the escape room with another YouTuber, Illusions Ghost. He's going to be test subject number one. And here we have Iron Oof, and I'm just going to be doing this with a lot of YouTubers. He is our first YouTuber. To do this like I said I will be doing youtubers this time and I delivered so here's our first youtuber okay he's ready okay he's locked in so all he has to do is go in and I told him the rules already so I do this and um so yeah he has to try to escape try to escape by the way so um Let's see if he gets it. Because there is a button under there. He seems to not know what he's doing. <laughs> Which is fine at first. Okay, he saw that one. It was actually over here. Uh, it was behind these. But look, it gave him a hint. Let's see if he can actually... Yep, he got it. Okay, now that unlocks the orange button in which you can unlock more parts of that. He did it. He got it. Okay, that's good. He got that. He didn't press that button. He Now he did. Um, he's making progress. Now, he can't get through yet, but he is getting pretty good. So let's just see if... Yep. Uh, he accidentally did that. Need to get a hint. Oh. Yep, he got it. Hello. So he may have did it, but, uh, yeah. I'm not sure if he saw that it got opened. Yeah, it got opened. So you guys know from my last video that the back over there is where you go through. Um, so yeah. Okay, he got it. Okay, so we have two at one accidental click for him. And one accidental click for illusion. Okay, so I'll tell him. In this, this room. So, yeah. He just keeps running into things. The chair is there, so it makes it feel like you can't go. Yep, he got it. He totally got it. Now, the point of this is you have to wait. You have to. It's supposed to make it seem like you're not, you didn't make any progress. But in reality, you made good progress. You actually. Uh, got the thing up and everything is good but you, he doesn't know that until it disappears now it takes a while for it to disappear I haven't put a limit on amount of hints because uh, people can need infinitely a many and I don't know how to organize them so that's why I didn't put a limit on it who get it Yep, he got it. The candle's not lit. <laughs> okay. Now he sees that. He sees that there's a hole there. Let's see if he realizes that this is also a balloon. Look behind you, look behind you, look behind you. Yep, I hopefully he saw that. That was a balloon. <laughs> now he's going to have to wait for that to go down. And it's just, he's so close to the second level. Now once that falls, you'll notice that you can get through. Now there is a skip that you may realize from the last video you jump on top of this and jump on that second level but what's the use you already unlocked this i designed it so if you want to you can go up that way and just skip this for no reason but or you can go up this and around and you can go up this and just go the normal way but some people decide otherwise so i think he's just waiting here for this to go like that just waiting waiting <laughs> yep, I think he answered his question. There you go. Now, he sees the purple button. Um, there we go. The purple button unlocks that door, which allows you to go up. Um, should allow you to. Yep, there you go. You just gotta give it a nudge, and you're good. So now he just has to click the purple button. Okay, so there you go found it 
right now he's on the second floor and now you're on the second level and there's also this thing again but it's different see like what I was saying uh, you can do this you can just uh, come up here but it was hard it's harder now and I also got this little system up here so yeah also this is just to a red herring it's just to distract you this is also uh, simple you can just click it and it unlocks that which unlocks this but you need three keys for this this is also a red herring right there um, and some other things what you need to do is you have to get in here he's gonna click that and think something happened it's very easy to miss I made it so people would not find it on their first time but he did now um yeah so he's gonna have to get find a way look he found that he could do that and he's going to realize very quickly he notices that but this does absolutely nothing this does nothing it is just simply to distract you and it looks pretty cool from outside. It's supposed to be ice, by the way, which it is ice, but, um, yeah. Okay. So he really only needs that last one right there. Over here. <laughs> yes. That one. I'm just gonna go down to the second floor, give him a hint. We're kind of on the first floor. Not the second. Um... On the first floor, something has opened up. So he, I told him something on the first floor. Something has opened up on the first floor. Um, see if he finds... Yep, he found it. Now hopefully he sees this. He's going to see it. Now he's hopefully going to see that. Okay, he saw it. All the balloons go up. And everything is happy. There's nothing else in here. Except for just decoration. He goes back down. And he comes back up. Realizes something has happened. And that button did something. Okay, I'm going to move that out of the way. Because it got... There, yep, he got it. So now he realizes, oh my gosh, it did that. And now, you can get your escape. And that is the end. Okay. Congratulations, as that block does something weird. So he can escape now with perfect timing. I don't know how much time that was. I'll check. So he actually did it. Congrats. You did a good job, Illusion. Gee. Look how many people joined. All of his fans. I did it. Yay. Okay. So this is just a little flag thing. All you have to do to complete it is get on the roof. You don't have to, uh, you know, do something else. Ah, okay. He won. He got it. GG. Yay. Thank you. Hi, Oof. Subscribe to him. He, uh did do a very good job um, and he should be congratulated okay so yep say bye bye hey guys welcome back it's 10876 here and here I'm here with the YouTube the G Jester and we're here to do the escape room um, so he's our third person to try the escape okay, room. okay guys so here we have spiny um, and, uh, he is doing the escape room now. He's a YouTuber as well. Uh, load the escape room. 
you get three hints. So you may have not uh, you may have realized that I have added a three hints rule, so you only get three hints. And last time they didn't exceed that thing, so they're fine. So oops. You must have uh, loaded in, uh click the button. Load the escape room. So I have a timer this time to time it live. So once he goes in, okay, good. His time has started. Um, yep, his time starts as soon as he gets in that door. There we go, his time started. Um, I will close this, and he is ready. He knows all the rules. And so do I. Um, he is off to a great start, actually. He just got the first two down. And I know I'm in for a world of editing once I start this. So, yeah. I'm going to add a new rule. Also, any time you click a block, you're not supposed to. It is plus 15 seconds. Okay. Uh, I'm going to restart his time. Because <laughs> uh, he may have he accidentally... I don't think he realized the rule. Okay, so. He got that button. And he, uh, the round just restarted. Because... Uh, he didn't, I don't, he didn't realize it was you couldn't press. First three done. He is like a speeding, um, thing. Like, he's like a race car. Um, he got that lever, I assume. Okay, so maybe he'll see, actually, I'll get, I'll get this, because, uh, out of all fairness, this does get you stuck, and I'm not going to let that hold it against you. So if you get stuck in there, I'll remove it. <laughs> so that should be, yep, he got that. So he's probably, he's the first YouTuber to actually see that there is a green thing behind it. All the other YouTubers pressed that lever first. Um, so they didn't get to see it. But this, the g gesture actually sees it. Oh, he got that thing untouched because he went in there. So he's good. Well, he got that done. And, uh, yeah, I'm sneaky. So he may not know, he didn't notice that there is a, uh, chill throw plushie. He got that one, and it removed that. So you still can't go through it, unless you're small, but you can't be small, because you just can't eat the candy. I'm not sure if you can get fit through that, if, even if you're small. Okay, so he's going pretty fast already. So he's going faster than any of the other YouTubers, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's only been a minute and 20 seconds. So he clicked it. Um, all he has to do is find go behind that shelf of a plushie. Over here. Yes, for a hint. Over here in this corner. Over here. Under something. Okay, over here and under something. So that's my hint I gave him. I'll just remove that because I have to get out and not break it. Okay, he got it. He saw the little button. Um... I think he accidentally clicked to that. Go to add some things so it doesn't just go. Um, yeah. There we go. So, um, that couldn't be misclicked. So I won't add the time. I don't think he intentionally did that. Um, so, yeah. Okay. This is going to be hard for him. Uh, well, it's going to be hard for every YouTuber. I'm just jumping on this. I'm not sure if you realize that. I'm just doing it right at random. So I'm going to go into here. It's been around four minutes so far. Okay. So he asked for a hint in this room. This was his first hint. So yeah. Yep, he found the back room. Which is where you get all the stuff. Okay, so he just activated the balloon, I think. So, yeah, um, in this room behind something. Okay, so we got his second hint. Um, I think he's going for speed. And, uh, yeah. Yep, he got it, he got it. 
whoops, I kind of moved around and messed up. <laughs> okay, S messed him uh, um, up. Okay, so it's just three. That's gonna open, and that's an automatic time reduction. Okay, I think he sees that there is an open spot. Yep, he sees it. So, that will fall. But I'm not gonna let it fall. So, there we go. Click the button. He's going upstairs. Time right now is 7 minutes and 30 seconds. So we got everything so far. He's close to finishing, but not too close. In this room. Okay, so he's the second hint, and I told him it is in this room, because it is again. Um, so... This button you can just reach from here. He presses that button and that's going to drop down. Now, there's some other things up there. See, those are the security things I was talking about. They were added originally, but if you uh, were here before or saw me use this beforehand, you may notice that this is not always here, it, oh, it used to only, only be red. Then I decided to add that. Let's just see if he realizes it's down here. Downstairs in the hidden room. And this whole room is the hidden room, but I guess he's assuming it's that hidden room. So, yeah, there's a little, yeah, there's a thing that drops down. So hopefully he can get up that, and if he can't, I'll just add a ladder to it. Okay, there we go, he got up. And there's a little button there, and this stuff all drops down. And he has activated that. There's nothing else in here, it's just basically a distraction. Okay, he's currently at 11 minutes. Um, so yeah. He got the button, all good. He should be able to now get to the final part. Now all he needs to do is click that lever and he'll be home free. Okay, so now that area is open. He's at almost 11 minutes, uh, so yeah. But I guess he didn't see the button. Um, so that's kind of bad. Okay, he's sitting on, he's sitting on the literal lever. Okay. He will be able to use the lever. And once he clicks it, he's at 12, almost at 12 minutes. And there it goes. <laughs> he got it. Yeah. To be at the exact right angle. At the exact. And he got it. And as soon as he exits, he's going to win. At, at almost there. And there we go, 12 minutes and 41 seconds. Congratulations. Congrats. See, it's possible. He did it, and his time was... Subtract, like, a couple seconds from there. His time was around 15 minutes and 6 seconds. Um, 15, oh, 6, uh, point oh. So here you get your little victory thing. So good game, the G gesture. Subscribe to Spiny on YouTube. I'll leave his link in the description. And that is the second heat of the uh, the finding of uh, the escape room. Well, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. He's going to be trying out my escape room. Um, I told him all the rules already. He already knows it. He's just jumping around here. Um, I'll let him start very shortly. We are here with a guy named Rural Ivan, also known as Aurora. Um, so he's going to be doing my... Uh, <laughs> my escape room and 
yeah, that's basically what this is. Okay, it's time has started, um, and the door is closed. Time starts now. Okay, so now we can. Uh, I don't have a timer yet, but I will keep it timed. Uh, I'll check the time once I get it done. So yeah. Yep, he hit the button. Um, now he can hit the button here if he sees it. Please see it. Please see it. See it? <gasps> yes, he saw it. Okay, he unlocked this now. Um, that's really cool. I think he sees the red button. Yeah, he got it. There we go. He got that button. Now he can. S he got the orange button. He's going crazy. He's he's flying. Okay, now all that's left is the yellow button, which is right here. Asked him if he needed a hint. Okay, so, under a table. There's a couple tables in here, actually. There's that one, there's that one, and there's that one. Um, and there's actually one right here, but that's not going to help. It's under one of those tables. I think the most easy to see is that one. He's having trouble getting out. Okay, so he pushed it over. Hopefully he gets this. <gasps> okay, well he got part of it, so that's that's good. So he sees it, but you have to find something else to get to it. Under a table. He um, asked for his fir first hint. He wasn't. He didn't get to be the first one to find it without a hint. Okay, he got it, finally. <laughs> he found it. Um, because he sat down and he actually saw it. So, he's gonna press the button and he's gonna unlock that. So he pressed it. Um, and he's all good. There you go, it's all gone. In this room. He has actually found the second button and he's ready to advance. Wait, wait, wait. He somehow must have activated the button accidentally, so I had to cover it up. But that's the only reason I'm doing this. Okay, so that thing opened. Uh, so this thing opened for him. Now he can get the blue one. Um, so yeah. Um, now in here, this is the hard part. Um, he assumed that the blue button would do something, but it didn't. See, oh, he's the first person to find that without actually needing help. He is actually, that's crazy. He actually found it. He is in the running for first place. It's going to open up there. Look, it opened up when he was looking directly at it. Um, so, I wonder if he'll see the blue button down there. Oh, he sees it. Oh my gosh. Wait. Is he actually get this? He's trying to press it. This is gonna be crazy if he gets it. Oh, he got it. Oh my gosh, he's on the running for the fastest person. Aurora is probably gonna be the fastest. My screen just did weird things. So, okay, so this is his last hint. He's having trouble clicking it. <laughs> Imagine how much trouble he's gonna have at the last one. Okay, so he got it, and it's floating up. This will be gone soon. Um, so yeah. Okay. So the thing fell down. Um, he clicked that. And now he's on the second floor. <clears throat> okay. That fell down. Now he can see the purple button. Ooh. He, he's good. Up. Oh, Hopefully he can hit the purple button. He's going to hit it. He's going to hit it. He's going to get it. There we go, he got it, and now he's on the second layer. Um, the second level, which is going to be pretty cool. He clicked that button. But I don't think he saw this button. That right there. Don't think he saw it. He clicked the button, but he didn't see it. Hopefully he could find it. He's, he found it, yay, and it fell on his head. Okay, he's going to press that. He got it. 
And now that unlocked, I'm not sure if he saw it though. Um, but he's on track pretty fast. <gasps> Is he going to see that? Is he going to see it? Okay, he got it. And um, now he unlocks the red one. He got it. Now those two are unlocked. And he has ability to go. This is, he's super quick. So he clicked that button. And now, um, some things have opened up. Okay, so he found the upstairs. And I think he sees, yep, he clicked the button. He found it. And now he can go um, see the other side. And it opened up. He finally found it. <laughs> so he asked for another hint, and his hint is downstairs in a room unlocked. So I haven't given this hint before, but this means, well, actually, I may have. I just said it differently. So it's downstairs, and it was, and it's in a room unlocked. That can mean this room. It can mean that room that was there. It can mean this. It can mean the secret room that was behind there. I mean the other, any other room. Okay, so we found, he's down here, uh, and he found the ladder. Um, he's gonna make it up, okay. He's in here, he probably sees that little, the button there, hopefully. He found the button, and now he is on his way to the end. Okay, now he's gonna realize that that whole area has opened up. And he has one more space to go. Okay, so he somehow got it from inside there. Um, I guess it's easier to click it through the wall because the, the wall detection is not that easy. And actually, the actual lever pokes out on the other side a little. Like, it's not visible poking out, but it pokes out of the render box. So now all he has to do is escape, and he has completed this challenge, which I say is pretty good. Now all he has to do is make his way back down and back up, and then press that lever and then he's completed this. Okay, so there's an open room now, and now all he has to do, all he has to do is go in and see, uh, check that seat out, and once he gets it, once he gets out, he gets the ability to win. So he chose to go in the other room and press it, um, which I see has worked for other people, like um, Omer, he, he, that worked for him, he did it. He actually did it. Okay, it worked the second time. That's actually the first time someone has did it that way. And it happened twice in a row with Omer and now the, uh, Aurora. So yeah. As soon as he comes out, he claims his pro he wins. So he's pretty good. As soon as he gets out. Okay, there we go. He is out and he wins. Good job, Omer. You have completed the escape the this thing whatever it's called good job and he's out that's amazing he is super quick wow gg congratulations squirtle live on you are extremely quick aka aurora um so yeah uh, if you see him whoa that just shot out everywhere <laughs> um so yeah Thank you guys for watching, see you in the next video. Please consider liking, subscribing, hit the notifications bell. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Waddleman76 here, and we are here with Sheik Zero, and she is here with, um, to play my escape room and see how fast they can go. Um, I still do not have a timer, I actually set timer, but yeah. Um, so they are the next contestant in the escape room. Um, so yeah. R-A-U-F, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but he has a YouTube channel, and he's on, he's going to try my escape room. Um, so, you may have realized, if you looked at the description of this video, you may realize we're having four more people try out, so that's four more chances for you. I know I said in the last video, we had to get to 25 likes, I said in the description, you probably didn't read it because I removed it. Um, so, yeah, but I just decided, you know what, let's expand it. I have more people that want to do it. So, um, it is not over. <laughs> you are, you can still come in. Okay, so, 
Um, he read all the rules, he knows everything, so I changed it up a bit, you may have realized. Um, there's no longer that shut thing, I added a little thing, like up here, a little firework. I also made it more secure, so you can't cheese it as easily. Uh, I think I, you can start, um, so you can go. Okay, time starts now. Um, keep hitting my mouse pad. Okay. I have to open the door. Go. Okay, his time has started. He's in. And he is going. Now that's a locked door now. Um, you may have also realized this. That has changed. This has changed so it's more secure. I added this and replaced that with a star. Um, he got that first thing. Um, there's some things I still need to make more secure. This is now changed so you can't like take this off. Um, just randomly by hitting the balloons. He also got the green lever while he's on fire. Um, uh, there's not much more I changed on the bottom floor. Uh, yeah. So he got that first one done. Um, that's just making sure you hit it. So if, I mean, you can hit it from here and you can still hit it, but like, it's literally just, just in case. Just in case. So he sees the red one. He got it, he's gonna click it. Now he gets the orange unlocked. He is extremely fast, it's only been a minute. <laughs> okay, she's going into the corner. She may see the red uh, the red button she's found. So they, are, they have found the orange button. Let's see if they actually found it or they just think they found it. Oh, yeah, they found it. Um, so they found the orange button. The yellow, whatever color that is. Um, now all they have to do is find the blue, light blue one. Also, you're wondering why I removed the top piece of this. It's so you can't clip into the top like this and hit buttons. So yeah, I know you could do it other places, but stop it here before it goes anywhere else. Um, so he's now looking for the yellow one, which is the hardest one again. Um, yeah. Oh wait, <gasps> will it be the... He may have seen it. Okay, he, I think he saw. Like he, I don't know if he saw it. Under a table. So he's getting all of his hints quickly. He's smart. He's he's like, you know what? I can't find it quickly, so mind as well ask for a hint very quickly. It's only been two minutes. I also moved the purple button over a little bit so you can't click it from a uh, up here or up here. Why did I say you can trust me? Okay, I meant you could press it. I was thinking of trust for some reason. <laughs> um, so he got that. There we go. He, see, it's possible. Really possible. So I gave, I'm giving her her first hint. And the first hint is it's under a table. Um, so yeah. <laughs> and it's this table. So if she finds it, yep. Nice, she f she got it the quickest, like she, she took the hint the quickest. She was like, oh, I see. So she found it, and now she can move that over there. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so she got the uh, that yellow border right there, and yeah, <laughs> I mean, no dark blue thing. Wow, she did that quick. Okay, she found the secret passageway, and now these are going to lift up. So yeah, she's currently at nine minutes. That's that's a good time. It's good. Now, I find more people are accidentally jumping into the back, so that's good. But there's actually three blue buttons. There's a light blue, a dark blue, and a medium blue. Well, normal blue. Um, oh, he found it. <laughs> that was very quick. Now, I, I, I actually I did add something in here. I added more security. So, as you can see, there's more purple blocks. So you can't just click it and then go. So, he got it. So now, um, that's going to open up. It's only been 4 minutes and 30 seconds. He's flying through this. If someone gets sub 10, that's amazing. Here, I should move this out of the way so he doesn't get stuck. 
Well, that disappeared now. Unless it just went into the other room, which it made of. No, it just completely disappeared. Probably like five seconds. Oh, there we go. Okay, short. Okay, so she's not in the room when that happened. But, okay, so we finally did it. But I don't think she realized it. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> now she realizes it. Okay, now will she notice the blue button? Will she? Oh, <gasps> she found the blue button. That's pretty cool. And she also unlocked part of that. So now all she needs is the purple button, and she is upstairs for the most part. She has two hints left, which is still pretty good. Um, now as soon as that comes down, she can go to the next thing. She's in the king's throne. That's beautiful. Okay. There we go. That finally opened up, and now she clicked the purple button. She can click it. There we go. The purple it is finally opened, and now you can go upstairs. Let's use it again. <gasps> okay, it opened up, but he wasn't near here to see it. Don't try. I'm just telling him not to try jumping up there, because you can get up there if you actually clip. So I don't want him to try getting up there. Um, yet. Yet. So he, he realizes he's a uh, completely new open thing. So now, he can go there. Press it. Hopefully he gets it. <gasps> he got it, finally. <laughs> okay, so that balloon's going to fly up. And now, <sighs> we wait. You can't use that emote? I can't use the emote? Oh, okay. I thought I could use E slash clap, but no, I can't, emote. Okay, so that opened up, and I'm dancing. <laughs> so he now can click that, and it'll open the thing. Hopefully he can get it. Please tell me he gets it. What the? What the? Okay, there you go, he got it. Oh. Or she do that. Okay, I'll just open up that for her because she kind of got stuck in there. I think she thought you were supposed to go up there, but you weren't. Um. Oops. Okay, so I don't even know how that happened. Despite the things that have happened, it's still going to take the same amount of energy to get the thing. I just had to change the color of the lever, so she had to unlock that. She must have accidentally clicked it, which happened before, so I guess I should change things up. Um, but, yeah. I mean, like, I should change the way they're there, here, hidden. Um, so, some of the things I added up here was a king chair right there for fun. I also sealed that up more, so you can't, like, secretly get it. Also, put this guy on a chair. I made this shorter, because it didn't really matter the other, other pieces. Um, where'd he go? Oh, he figured out that there was... Oh, you remember that there was a purple thing there. And that... Okay. Okay. He clicked... Oh, wow. He got that very early. So let's see if she... Oh. She gets this. I would be super surprised. Once this thing's open up, we'll know she got it. And if she got it. Okay, I don't think she got it, actually. Oh, wait, she's gonna get it. Up, oh, she got it! <laughs> That's cool. Now all she needs is that last lever, um, and then she can escape. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I have, to, I have to move that for her. She still has two hints left. Now you just gotta click that. Um... So yeah. Oh wow, he got it. He actually clicked it from that way. So, um, <laughs> he's gonna have trouble getting that. Okay, so the little button on the side of it is kind of facing down. Um, so let me check. I can. Okay, this isn't supposed to happen. You hit it down there, it's gonna get stuck. This is my. Oh, he actually got it. Okay, so she sees the button lever right there. Now all she has to do is click it, and she is able to leave. 
that quickly. Oh, she finally got it. Okay. She actually got it. And she finally escaped with 18 minutes and 55 seconds. I can't get out. Um, congratulations, Sheik O, oh, for completing my escape room. You know. Congratulations, Sheik O. Oh. Sheik Zero. I'm sorry, I only say different things than people's names. So, yeah. Thank you for participating. Um, you are a very big help and contributed very much to this. Um, so yeah, I feel bad now, but he actually got in re decent time, so, okay, he got in decent time, oh wow, oh my gosh, he's, he could finish it, he could finish it, he could literally finish it right now, at 11 minutes, and he could, if he gets 12 minutes, it's gonna be cool, but he's very slim now, click it, click it. <gasps> he got out, okay, I got out, and he is gonna make it in. He made it in 11 minutes and 55 seconds. That was insane. He still has this big balloon out here. We can press the little firework I added. That's amazing. Yes. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Yeah. That was crazy quick. Oh my gosh. Thank you. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. If you like this, please consider liking. If you want to see more, please subscribe. Tell your friends, family, other people you know. Have a nice day. Hey guys, welcome back. It's one hundred seven six here, and today we are here with Kamaplin, and he's going to be doing the um, the escape room. You already know the rules, hopefully. You already know the stuff. So let's hop right into it. We are here with RapidQ to try out my escape room. He knows all the rules, and you probably know him from his amazing builds. He has a YouTube channel around like, I don't know, I haven't checked since like three months ago, so I last it was 4,000 subs, I don't know. Um, but that's besides the point. He's going to be doing our escape room. Um, so yeah, uh, once I give him the signal, he's allowed to go in. Um, so yeah, go, and as soon as they go through that door, he goes through the door, yep, time starts. Um, so yeah. And, let's see. Three, two, one, go. There we go. He's entered in, and now his time has started as soon as he entered that room. Okay, I think he sees the red button. Okay, <laughs> he got it. So he got that one, and he also got the orange one. Um, now all he has to do is get the green and yellow one. Okay, now I think he sees the button back here, and if he does, yep, there we go. He clicked to that, and now he can see the orange button. And my escape room part, oh, he also got the green one. My escape room part two is going to have more complicated things, like that's not going to be there. It's going to be a little bigger room, just so you guys know. Also, it's 3 a.m. when I'm recording this. Button. Oh, wow, he must have seen it. If he gets this, he's the first one without a hint to get this, I think. Pretty sure. <gasps> He's the first one. Oh my gosh. First time I've seen someone do that. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Rapid might have found it. Yes, he actually found it. He got it without a hint. That's really cool. Um now he's just stuck. So they asked for a hint for the green one. It is near a food item. So we have a range of food items, like the cake and the pumpkin. Um, let's see if they... Yeah, I think he found it. Okay, he found that one. And now, all he has to do is go find the one behind there. He, got, he asked for his first hint, and his first hint is behind a chair. So we asked for another hint on the same thing, so I'm going to give a more specific hint. Go for the behind a chair. Maybe walk behind even if it doesn't look possible. Okay, so my second hint for the first, for the, for, uh, for the one thing is go physically behind a chair. Maybe walk behind it even if it is, doesn't look possible. It is in... The secret room.
Mm -hmm. He now found his way behind that, and he pressed those two buttons. Now we can go back out. Okay, he's currently at 10 minutes and 16 seconds. So he, uh, he wants another hint. Um, okay. Their hint is behind a chair. That could be any chair. Um, so yeah. And they found it. And now that should open up soon. Now I may see the blue button. Okay. Well, that opened instantly, so... So I had to improvise because he accidentally clicked the balloon. So now he has to wait for that balloon to open. So I'm pretty sure he got himself stuck. Okay, there we go. The balloon thing opened, and now he can go down and through that. Now I'll open this up for him because he accidentally got stuck up there. Okay, that is opened up, so they can now get that bu blue button, and will they get it? I think they see it. Oh, he got it. He got the blue button, and now you just have to wait for that. Okay, finally dropped down, and now he is ready to get it. Okay, he's going to press the button, and almost. I'm assuming. There we go, he got it. Okay, he's up. So he hit the pink button. Now all he has to do is get the pink button. Well, he hit the, that pink button, the purple button. Now he has to click the pink button. Okay, I think he's seen the pink button. Okay, there we go. The uh, pink button. Thing that came out of the pink button actually fell on top of him. Now he clicked the. Okay, there we go. There's the balloon. Now he clicked the red button. All he has to do is get the green thing. So yeah. Now he is ready for part two. Will he get, oh, he hit that immediately. Will he get the pink button immediately? No, he won't. Okay, he got the that one. And that has been activated. Now all he needs to do is activate the green one. So, Rep Q is going into the back room. Now he probably realizes that that ladder is down. Now I can press that button. Um, he pressed the button. Now he can officially go in there. Now all he has to do is get the lever from the chair. Okay, so they've asked for another hint. Their hint is in a secret room inside of another. And that's their hint for the next one. Okay, they act. He activated. He activated the green one, and now he is ready to go upstairs again and check out the last lever. Oh, <gasps> he actually got it. Okay, that was pretty quick. Congratulations, Rappaku. You completed it in 17 minutes, 37 seconds, 0.45. Okay, Kamaplan has finally got it. As soon as he exits, his time's up. There we go. He got it. He won. Good game. GG. Good job. He activated his little firework. Kamaplan did a very good job, but now it's time for me to sleep. So, yeah. So, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video. If you like this, please consider liking. If you want to see more, please subscribe. Tell your friends, family, other people you know. Have a nice day. Hey guys, welcome back. It is Waddle976 here. And we are here with another popular YouTuber called Forlape, or Tubro2. Um, <laughs> so, he is going to be doing my escape room today. We are here with XXDarkVoid4XX. And he is going to be doing my escape room. Um, he knows all the rules and all the other stuff. And, uh, yeah. You may notice it's completely remodeled because I had to fix some things, make it more nice looking. Um, so yeah, that's that's all the differences that happened. So um, he knows all the rules. I can just paste them right now. No, don't launch the boat. Why did I just say that? There, there's all the rules. Um, he needed them again. 
So yeah, let's let's get inside. And I usually put this in my hand. Um, okay, once you open the door, uh, your time starts. So we we'll open the door, and once he enters it, his time starts. Gotta watch very closely. Go, it's time to start. What? <laughs> okay, so he's in, and he is—he's ready to destroy this course. <laughs> you can go if you want. <laughs> okay, so yeah. Oh wait, I forgot. <laughs> I'm dumb. Okay, now his time has started. Um, so you may notice everything is recolored. Yes, it's pretty. I'm not sure if I made a video on this in the past, but I sure. I'm not sure. Um, we have a window in the back now, so it's all pretty. Um, so yeah. Um, we also have this. Hmm. <laughs> I added some things to the table, like a buttons. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, let's see. Hopefully, you know those. Are, yeah, they don't activate it. We have like uh, new foods on the tables. Like we have a lamp now. Um. That's for the new stuff. Okay. Okay, so we got that one. I keep saying K because that's just my words. Um, so he obviously got this. I heard the sound. It sounded like a pear being stepped on. Um, so th there I also um, have this more secure now. Um, I think he's going to get this button now. Cool, he got the red one. Good job. Um, now all he has to do is get the orange button, which is right there. Yeah, he got the orange button, and he's on a great start. Okay, I think he found the first, more of a lever, the orange lever. He's kicking the ball against the rules. No, but it doesn't help whatsoever. That's my response. Okay, so, I think he's going to find the red button. And this time, there we go, he found it. Um kind of hidden away. I didn't realize how hidden it was since I last placed it. Okay, he didn't find the orange button um, yet, which that's probably going to change. He changed it, so he did find the orange button. Now all that's left is yellow and green. Um, so yeah, now he, the hardest one is back here, so he may not get that, but I think he sees it. He definitely sees it. Okay, he sees it, I think. No, he doesn't. Okay. Okay, then. Okay, he wants a hint. Um, so, I'll give... This one basically work for both, so under a table. Table. Okay, he has to reserve it. It's under a table. Um, pretty sure I said that, but when I edit things, it kind of doesn't work, so... Hello, if I don't edit this out. <laughs> So now he's reinvestigating this table to uh, see if there's a button there. Let's see if there. The, does the buttons to actually stay yet stood? Okay, I was making sure I didn't change the color of it and accidentally uh, mess with him. Up oh, there we go, he got it. Okay, now it's rolling around. Wait, what? What just happened? Okay, nothing happened. Um, okay, so he's moving it around. Uh, hopefully, he gets that one. I always forget to mention you can push the foil blocks um, because they're off ground. Okay, so only I didn't give him a hint. It was just general knowledge. I forgot to mention I have to put that in the rules that you can move foil blocks. Um, there we go. He got the yellow one. Um, there's also new stuff in here, I think. Mm, or not. Okay, so. Okay, he found the green thing I was about to say yellow um, good job now all he has to do is find the light blue one then click the yellow button since he's so tall I think I'll just remove the chairs from there because um, honestly it's gonna hurt him because it's obvious look what it's doing right now <laughs> okay okay I only removed the chairs for him because his character kept glitching um, Still possible to find that one. Okay. So now he, he won't like glitch through the ceiling or anything. 
so it doesn't look like he's cheating. Okay, I think he found the blue button, maybe? Okay, so I asked for him for a hint, he said yes. His hint is it's under a table. Um, and it's the light blue one, um, and he just has to find it. I'm gonna sneeze. Okay, um, I'm back. There we go, he found it the second I gave him the hint. Um, you can push foil. Okay, so he can push foil all he wants. Um, so yeah, hopefully he understands that you can push it there and, you know, get the, uh, the entrance open. There we go, he opened that one. And now he is inside the secret room place thing. Hopefully he doesn't clip inside or anything. Oh, a second hint. He asks, bit, bit. He asks for a second hint. It is behind a chair. So I think there's two hints for the button that I give hints for. Wait, what? <laughs> yep, there's Swervos there. Ah. Uh, Okay, so he has just found um, this one, so that'll expand. Um, now, I'm pretty sure he sees that. Uh, so yeah, so it takes a little time for those to go off, but they will soon. Why does it take so long to pop? Okay, there we go. Um, he's now got this one. Um, so I think he sees that one. There we go, we got that balloon. Um, this is a pretty good start for him. Okay, so he wants another hint. I'm going to give him the hint for this one. Uh, it is behind a chair. So we're talking about the one that is hidden behind the Swervos. Um, so yeah. There we go, he found it. He found the one behind the chair. He unlocked the balloon. Um, and there we go, he's all good. Now all he has to do is wait for this one to undo. Okay, it undid itself now, and he is free to go in that little room place. Um, so yeah. Maybe he sees the blue button. <gasps> there we go, he found the blue button, and he is good. Oops, sorry. Wait, he can't hear me. Why did I just say that? <laughs> there we go. That one has fallen down because the balloon has popped. And he should get that button. Um, okay, there we go. He got the button. The door is falling. And he is going up. Okay. I also have a new chair in here. I'm not sure if that was in the last one, but I don't know. There's also a window up here for viewing pleasure. Also change this to, like, all of that. Instead of just some. Um, there we go. He got the pink one, I think. Okay. So, the thing fell down. And now, he can go up here. Okay, hopefully he sees the purple button. And... Almost, hopefully. Maybe he'll find it. I, I think he sees it. He just can't click it. Okay, he got it. So there we go, he goes upstairs now, and now his part two thing, whatever it's called. Okay, so he clicked the first pink button, and he found the pink button, and found a red button, or dark pink, like I'll call it, because <laughs> it's very, very dark pink. Kidding, it's not pink at all, it's red. Um, we have a little chill thrill in the chair. It's chill thrill in a chair. Chill thrill in a chair. In a chair, in a chair. No, wait, yeah. He clicked the purple button. He also got the pink one. There we go. He got the pink button. And now has the... Ooh, that was close to glitching out. He has the red one. The red button now. And all he has to get is the, the green one and the white one. Or whatever one that is. Sand colored. Okay, he wants another hint, and the final hint is, it 
is in a secret room. So that is obviously that secret room in the side of the wall, but, um, so I'm talking about the secret room that's behind the chair. Okay, he's going, going down here to check for the secret room, and he's going back, and he's going to check in this secret room, hopefully. Yep, and he finds the ladder, which will lead him up here, um, and to the next button. Hopefully he clicks it. Yep, he got it. Okay, now all he has to do is come back down and then get the one in the chair. Okay, I was kind of in his way by accident, but that's fine. Okay, he has one button left, and that one is the chair. He's going down, he hasn't had a hint. Okay, maybe he's going to find it. Hopefully he does. Okay, does he? Will he? He found it. Good job. Okay, so he found the secret back room that opens up once you get all the keys or buttons or whatever they're called. Um, maybe he sees the little, like, pink, green, whatever color button it is. Hopefully. Okay. There we go, he found it. He found the light green button. And now he's going to be up soon. Um, yep, there he goes. And now I'm upstairs too. Okay, so that unlocked now. The whole room place unlocked. Oops. Um, I, th I think he needs a little help with that. I feel bad I made this a little too small for him. There we go. Perfect size for him. I didn't expect anyone to have like an R15 model to tall. So, usually it takes people a while to get this one, um, but hopefully you can get this quickly. Not because I don't have time, just because... <gasps> he got it! Oh my gosh! That's the first time someone got it very quickly. Okay, so as soon as he exits it, exits the room, he has won. Yeah, this opened. Oh my gosh. Okay, hopefully that didn't take too much time, but okay. Uh, I have to play by the rules, so as soon as he exited, that was his time. But he actually did really good, I think. Okay, so he asked for a hint, and his hint is, it is in a chair. Oh, he got it. Okay, so he's gotten it. I was about to tell him it's hard to click, because... Sees he was having difficulty, and his time start stops right now. There we go. Good job, X X for Dark Void XX. Um, congratulations on completing the escape room. Good game, four lap. You did a very good job at the escape room. Um, this is now the top of the roof. Now, by the way, we have a little candy room. Um, we have a new and improved one that isn't as gloomy. We have chairs up here, seven to be exact. So seven people can sit up here um we have our chimney we have a railing now so you don't fall off so yeah thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next video if you like this please leave a liking congratulations for, for completing this have a nice day please subscribe to his channel okay so uh please subscribe to him he's a pretty cool youtuber so yeah thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next video if you like this do please consider liking have a nice day. In this video, two popular Roblox YouTubers are going head to head but four months apart to see who can get the fastest time on my escape room. The rules are simple. I'll leave them in front of the screen and I'll explain them like at least two times this video. Anyway, please make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, join the Discord or any other things I have in the description. It's much appreciated. My videos have been getting a lot of views recently and I'm really grateful for that. So thank you. Um, let's continue with the video. Okay. So, come in here. So, I'm in a VC with that diner dude. And he can hear what I say. He's not talking, because he doesn't have a mic, and that's fine. Hello, welcome to 150 at night. Uh, so, I basically brought in this guy named Velocity. Um, he is going to be true at doing our escape room. And, um, I know I haven't done a lot of these, and it's actually almost the one year of the anniversary. Um, but here's the rules. Escape room rules. No breaking blocks, no clicking butter or balloon blocks, no randomly tapping stuff, no clipping into things, or trying to stay in first person. You only get three hints if you break everything. Anything you restart, only press buttons or levers. You can push foil blocks once they are detached. 
This is actually going to be the first time I'm doing a call, which um, is something I never really do. But um, I decided to do it this time because you suggested it. And this is my new computer and I actually on it here and not a, um, whatchamacallit, not on my Mac. So that's fun. Okay, um, I'm going to get something, something called Live Split open, so I can do it live, obviously, if it wants to open. I'm gonna make sure I am on it. Okay. Now, whenever you want, you can enter the room. Actually, on the count of um, at one, you can enter. So three, two, one. Your time starts now. So thank you for joining us today. This is actually the first one I've ever read a PC with. So hey, glad you could read all the rules. This is actually you're the first to try out this brand new setup. Um, so yeah, I'll start timing you as soon as you get in the door. Um, so whenever you feel ready, I will open the door. You can enter, you get three hints. Um, those hints depend on where you are, what you're doing, and how far along you are. Okay. You're in first person, correct? I didn't realize that thing could do that. Okay. By the way, I recommend keeping out. Oh, wow. Like. And I don't know. Whatever one. <laughs> Wait. Four. Yeah, you can't click anything before. Okay. So. You seem to have gotten. The, oh wow, I didn't realize it did that. Okay, you seem to have gotten the buttons so far. That's really good. All, uh, almost all of them. <laughs> I haven't done this in like three months. So, yeah, you got the red button. And then you got the orange button. Yeah, there. Can I go in now? Yep, all good. I just have to lock this in front of you. So yeah. What am I supposed to? Uh, you try to find the buttons. Remember, uh, don't click buttons. Like, don't randomly. Oh, the, I'm supposed to find where I'm su supposed to. You're supposed to find buttons, yeah. Beep. I can't click on this. Um, that's a lever. So yeah, if you want to click on first button. Okay, so he got the first one, which was a green lever, which unlocked this part, and it unlocked. The part back here, which you cannot really see because it's kind of blocked. Let's see. So let's see if we can find the next one. Oh, and you got the green le green lever. Now all that's left is the yellow one. You can see the yellow buttons there, which does not activate those. But huh? I think you might have clicked the uh this the uh, balloon. Hey, who cares? Still, doesn't matter. There's a backup just in case. Got to find the uh, way to release the. These are foil blocks, by the way. I don't know if it's saying it. That yeah, works. Oh yeah, don't look up there. That is uh, here. I think yeah. Why is a window fall out? I don't know. Yeah, but you yeah, don't look up there. That's weird. Windows just randomly fall out because that's normal. Hint. Okay. It is under a table. That is your first hint that it is under a table. Oh, jeez, some things are falling off of random parts. Wow, it's weird. Okay. Don't worry, the button's still where it is. <laughs> I'm just looking around and seeing things randomly fall off. Um, another hint? You know, there's a second level. It is under a plushie. That is your second hint. It's all kind of weird for me just doing it with the person, because usually I'm used to, uh, you know, doing it alone, but yeah. Sucker. Yeah. Surprisingly, some people broke the game with this soccer ball. Like, it literally broke how they played. Um. The soccer ball is just Wait to break it. <laughs> okay, I was kidding. Ooh, looks like you're finding the... I, yep. Cool, nice. Okay, so we found the next one. Uh, I see the other one. Yep, and he found the one. Can click on. There we go. He is almost through this. Oh, part. they are different. Yeah, 
there's a three it's a three-way block so you can see that this one's connected to something I think I see some oh yeah oh Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh. <gasps> Don't tell me. I can't click on it. Okay, so you see it? Okay. Oh, <gasps> you're the first one of the you. I think the second or third, maybe the first that ever got that without a hint. Okay, I see what this does. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so he finally opened it. Why did I say finally? You're doing really good on that. Okay, so you opened Beep. the. Beep, 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 beep. Hey, you got it. Hopefully it doesn't run away or anything. I really hope it doesn't like spaz out of existence. Hey, you got it. Okay, now you're here. Okay, so he's got that button. Seems like he's already gotten the lever. The lever used to be more hidden, sadly. Aging of the game made it easier to see. But, you already found it, luckily. Oh no. Yeah, I gotta just... Uh, I have to replace this, because it should not be broken yet. Don't worry, I can easily fix that. The, uh, you can't, you aren't supposed to go behind... Can't go behind this yet. The, uh, yellow thing was not supposed to have a balloon. Um, behind a chair. You are at seven minutes right now. By the way, this this is not supposed to be here. It's supposed to. Once you find the yellow button, you'll uh, be able to get that. Okay, behind a chair. <clears throat> I'll tell you, it's not behind this. Ooh, it seems like he has found the back room with the secret button. And now, you should unlock this new area. And once the balloon takes that away, it'll be locked. Hey, okay, it's open. And that unlocks. Oh, you f he found the thing, the uh, the blue button, and now um, that unlocks the balloon. Now it's just a little more waiting because fun, best game mechanic. So you found the back area, and now you have two left. Oops, sorry. You have two I feel like it's lava. Oh wait. Oh, mm. again close. Thing, not sure, but I have a feeling that this. <gasps> Wait, what? Ooh, you found it. You found the secret area. I accidentally entered. Okay, I was right. Yeah, you did fine. Um, did you did that activate the thing? <gasps> oh, it did. It activated the this. See this outer yellow coating. Block. Yeah. That's how it activated. Let's see if you got that. Listen. Ooh, you got it. You got the orange yeah, I'm button. Stuck. You got the I'm gonna speed run. <laughs> yeah, but oh, sad speed. sadly balloons take time to do things, so. Just gotta say, you're doing pretty good on time. Um, the five minute mark is just coming up. And I can look at the score. Are the fastest on Robux? So okay, I was kidding. You are going pretty fast in comparison to a lot of people. I think the fastest time is like. Oh, 13. what? Up, is opened. this meant to. Yeah, it opened up. Now that you. I see button. this blue button. I'm pretty sure you open. Oh. Ooh, you found that. Wow, it's really good. Ooh. Ooh. Can't click any buttons first. Ah, uh, that's one of the harder ones. Ooh, you got it. There you go. Boom. Ooh. Guess I can get up here. Oh, am I supposed to? Uh, oh, yeah, I see the purple button. Yeah, you don't have to go up there, you just have to... We. Oh, you oh, I thought it's an open up. Yeah, it's... Oh, shoot. My bad. Um... I have to get out my... tool that... breaks this thing, because apparently I have it anchored. You need to get... Okay, I was... Okay, sorry about that. I'll deduct like 10 seconds on that. 
or five. I don't know. Eight. Another one. Yeah, I'll take Eight. off. That side looks so peaceful. <laughs> Ooh. Looks. It is now unleashed. Oh, there you go. Okay, so now you've reached floor two. Ooh. Is hit the pink lock thing? Whatever, pit, pink button, that's what it is. Also, if you not know, I updated this so it's slightly transparent. And he's gotten the pink button, which unleashes a thing with red buttons on it. That should unlock something somewhere. And it could be anywhere. If you don't see something come unlocked, your A, it's waiting, or B, it's somewhere completely different, or somewhere you already explored. Usually probably hidden, I don't know. You, by the way, you aren't supposed to get behind this big green wall. You are not. You'll eventually unlock it. <laughs> okay, that balloon just disappeared. Remember to search places you've already searched, even if you may not have not seen anything happen may happen in other places and this is a two-floor um, escape room Let's see the button <laughs> that's a lot of butt pops yeah I thought that was oh. this was made before the lighting update so it's, it's much more brighter hi shoe every time i see shoe i get suspicious how can I not see it? You see it? Oh, you found it. I forgot you. Can't click on... Where yeah, I click on... Oh, there's one button. Yeah, some of these buttons you gotta... Ooh, there you go. Oh, shoot. Two. Right in your way. Beep. Okay, I... Yes. It's another one of those movable blocks. I like to use those because they seem fun. Cool, you got that. Yes. You're nearing very close to the end. With. I can button. tell. I think I saw a button behind you. I don't know if that is a button or. You have I think hints. that's just. A... You have three little hints left, by the way. I don't need to use it. But. I'm going to push it for fun. No, no. Okay. Shoot, you got yourself stuck. Um, I'll just remove that. There you go. We good. <laughs> Mm. Oh. Now you don't have to bring it up, I'll just, you know, like just oopsie. Don't, you did it, Ed. Don't act like that's gone. That won't affect the gameplay. Trust me. <gasps> <Yo. laughs> oh, you found it. The secret. Well. Wow. There you go. Okay. Yeah. Now, will he find it? That is the question. Yes. Boop! <gasps> you did it! Oh my gosh! Nice. GG, you're almost there. Home stretch. Super speed run. Okay, he's going back into this room. And he's going back up. Going back to that here. It's not letting you climb it. Uh, here. You're supposed to be able to climb that here. Does that work? Oh! Hey! Hey! Okay, so. Now he's gotten up here, and he's found the secret hidden room, where he now sees this hidden button under the table, and now he's unlocked something else. He's now unlocked the last area. He's gotten to finish that part. What is this? This is uh, where the block fell from. Sorry that I deleted it. It just got stuck. Um, so he is getting very close to the end. Now he has unlocked a new area. And let's see what he can make that up. Is that a button? The thing. I don't know if that's a or not. But click on. That's a. By the way, buttons and levers are okay. I don't know if my sign said that. 
Oh, that that's a lever. I can see. I can see. But I can't click on it. That's luck. It's the last area. It will be unlocked soon. And with a time of... By the way, you have to escape. 14 minutes and 38 seconds. He has escaped the escape room and won the prize. Congratulations, you have finished the escape room. We'll, I'll let you know about your results. Congratulations, you have completed my escape room in 11 minutes, 50 seconds, in at 0.95. Now, since I had that, those two little breaks in between that like mess things up, I'm gonna change this um, time to 11 minutes and 40 seconds because of my mistakes. So, thank you for playing this. Uh, you're the first person to play on this version of it. Um, I will check back again um, on a later date to see if you make it to the, like, the second, the second part, part two, because currently, um, you are the first, um, of two people. I don't know who's coming against you yet, so you'll have to wait and see for the video to be uploaded. And yeah, thank you for joining here. I'll leave the link to his channel in the description. Thank you for participating. We'll see how you stack up against your opponent very shortly. So, this video actually has been in the making for a couple months now, because the first one I part of recorded was actually a couple months ago, when I first got this computer. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this, please consider liking. If you want to see more, please subscribe. Tell your friends, family, other people you know. Have a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Bye! I just take up. Bye. It is this the final escape room video where new people are going to be involved. All the next ones after this are going to be winners from the past eight videos of escape room. Today we have Wild Blue Luck and Telsarin. Please make sure to subscribe and subscribe to those channels. Many of you are not subscribed actually, and probably a weird YouTube glitch, and a lot of you aren't watching my videos. So make sure to subscribe. Make sure to make other people subscribe. Without further ado, let the video begin. Hello, this is Waddle1876 here, and we are here with the YouTuber, I think by the name, Rissalit444, uh, also known as Til Tilsarin. I can be completely mispronouncing that. There are rules. Uh, read rules. Rule number one, no breaking blocks. Rule number two, no clicking butter or balloon blocks. No, rule number three, no randomly tapping stuff. Rule number four, no clipping into things you're trying to. Rule number five, stay in first person. Rule number six, only get three hands. If you break anything, you restart is rule number seven. Rule number eight is only press buttons or levels. And rule number nine is you can only push world blocks when they are detached. <gasps> okay. You got all that? Okay. Okay, good. Yeah, I got it. So, we, we follow this path to... A non-suspicious mm -hmm. door that says Escape Room by Water1876. Make sure you yeah. read the rules. So you know the rules? Yeah, I see the rules. Good, and so do I. Um, so as soon as you enter that door, your time will start. And I'll have to open the door, obviously. But um, Yeah. So, anytime you're ready, enter. Okay. Your time has started. Amen. Your time starts... When you enter, your time starts when you enter. Okay, so three, two, one, there, in. Okay, so, um, yes, and levers. That one looks so demonic. Okay, it, we just had to restart once. He accidentally clicked a balloon. That's fine because you get to start again. You can now see I improved it. There is now um, 
Why is that just a line? I don't know what this is, but um, the windows are now windows and all that stuff. Um, time starts to see. Okay, there you go. Okay, he's found the first green lever, and that is the first one to the series. He's found the red button, and he's second one, and the orange button. He is flying. Can I click buttons? Um, yeah, buttons, but not butter blocks. Yeah, yeah not butter. So and levers. You can click levers. Why is chill down there? Just chill. It's, a lot of this stuff is just, just decoration chill. and stuff. Yeah. It's just funny. He's lying under the table. Yeah. Some things may not be decoration. Some things may look like decoration, but are actually oh. things. Yeah, they're actual... Oh, I found a lever. Ah, nice. I heard a glue. Okay, so he got the first layer of this door, which is behind the two yellow, yellow and orange oh. bricks. I like to click this chest. Oh, is it a decoration? Uh, the, ch the chest does nothing. Uh, I just wondered if it's that fig. Nah. Or if it's just de deco. Deco. You can click it. The chest you can click I because it's useless. I, f I think it's, I found some... Is, um, yeah, this is a button. It's just... This, yeah, there you go. I broke that. It, now I get to sit down. Yep. I've unlocked the ability to sit. There you go. Completed the escape room. All done. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I've unlocked the ability to sit. I just realized I missed a pixel in this window. Okay, that sucks. That's sad. Yeah, I'll have to fix that. You're the last person doing the escape room. I don't. Even if I fix it, it's gonna do no. No, actually, you know what? I have a different idea for this escape room. What? Is it? What's this? I you can click that. One. All right. Do not what? I don't know where it is, but I did tear a balloon. All right. So you seem to have gotten the second layer of protection behind the yellow wall. Um. So, yeah, that's it's good. <laughs> so this yellow wall, I think, is a balloon. Um, yeah, I'll tell you that, but it's not like it matters. I'm not going to click it. Don't click it, it, yeah. Does it have to be activated? Yeah, oh, it has to be activated. How do I... Is there any buttons that will drop this weird There is, block? yes, there is. I'm, say, I'm saying if it's hidden around here. It is hidden, because... So it has to be in, in proximity, or it's not going to break it. Yes. Okay, let's see if you can find the other one. The last piece of the puzzle. He seems to have found the button that unlocks the place inside there in the lever. It's the lever. That's good. He has asked for a hint. Hint one is it is under a table. That is his first hint. And... Yeah, good. It is under that table, but he does not know that yet, or does he know it? Seems he may have found it. He has not. And he has found it. He has found the blue button that unlocks the yellow button, which goes to the yellow door. And he has locked this the secret place, I think? I don't know what to call this. He's unlocked the secondary area. The bottom half of the candles are mixing. I found half. a fig. Yep, there you oh, go. That. You got the next part of the door. Why is this room with a checkerboard? Am I just not supposed to? Do I need another? Um, you got one of the buttons of it, so that's part of it. Yeah. You unlocked part of the window. No, window. I need to figure out what button breaks this. It's obviously a light blue button. You're not colorblind, right? Yeah, I'm not colorblind. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, you'd have a problem. I'm just checking if it's hidden in a pumpkin <laughs> or something. I'm just checking around. Uh, could I have a head? Um, it is under a table. It's under a table. Not this one. Does chill, it? Does chill only exist to cover up the button or something? Possibly. I won't give you a straight answer to that. <laughs> yeah, it's very hard to see. Cause chill is in the world. Also, turbo is in the world as well. Yeah. Look at everything from different oh. angles. Is that'll help? I just clicked that for no reason other than to click it. You can click the yellow like buttons. Under a table. Might be this one. Mm -hmm. oh, I spotted it. <laughs> I've discovered it because of the floor texture. Oh, there you controlled. go. Move now. Okay. Wait, okay, not that wall. Nope. 
Oh yeah, I have to push it to the yellow. Duh, I'm through this way. There's pumpkins now. Yep. This is new like part. Oh yeah, bud. Doesn't seem to do much. Okay. There's mouldy bread as well. <laughs> yeah. It looks it's either mouldy or just covered in moss. <laughs> both, both are very possible. <laughs> both. Oh, he knows there's something back there, and he has found yet another button in here, which unleashes the big balloons. There it goes, it is opened, and he has, he may find the blue button in there. He has, congratulations. Um, he now just has to wait for that to pop too. Also, I removed the chairs from this place because it was getting in the way of people actually getting, and they clipped into this place, so that's kind of not good. I think I found one of them. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you could just walk through here. Yep, there you go. Told you, I had used the utilized every single I made a ballon. I made a ballon. Oh, I Ooh. see like pink stuff up there. I need to find a pink button. Mm -hmm. If I want to drop the. Oh, yeah, so you have to get the ladder down. Oh. I've opened up a new space where this balloon is. You're the first one that actually is noticed. The fig... You're the first one that noticed that purple sticky block. <laughs> Wait, oh, yeah, the ones with the ladder. Mm -hmm. No one noticed them. Just waiting for this balloon to pop. Yeah. Okay, okay, so the balloon popped. spotted pop. a button. Spotted a button. It's blue. I feel it's... like it won't do that much, but I'll... Oh, it did a little I, I think it did something. <laughs> it, yeah, just because I, you said you had a couple bad buttons that don't do no. Yeah. It doesn't help to click... To it doesn't hurt to click the bad button. It doesn't hurt to click the ones that do nothing, though. No. Yeah, just in case they do something. Yeah. Not like they're gonna, like, reset the stage. <laughs> just explode everything. <laughs> what if there's like, but what if there was like a escape room, but if there's like trap buttons that like you know either like block you in, yeah, or, or something, or like just reset a bit of progress by breaking something, yeah, so you have to get the second one. That'd be a lot of work. It. Yeah. And I'm not, and I, I'm not for doing work. I'm just waiting for this balloon here. Yeah. Because it went off. It, it, the balloon oh, popped. If I look at it from an angle, I found a pink button. Hey, you got it. I can click it from, I can click it from this far. Okay. I just got to get the right. Oh angle. wow, you're right. You can. Okay, so you found the okay. second floor. Second floor. This is the second floor. Wait. Enjoy Wait, your stay. I, I'm gonna go check if that ladder fell down, or if that was a different shed. Oh, the ladder's here. Hey, too. you're the first one that actually got that. Like, actually figured out the ladder fell after that button. Yeah. Am I supposed to be here, or should I advance to the second floor? Oh, no, no, but if you I unlock the area. Like this... If you unlock yeah, the area, just you... check around this area. Yeah, go for it. See if there's anything. There's a, there's a pile of lump. There's a lump of locks and a button under here. Hey. I activated a balloon. There you go, you I'm found it. I'm gonna go back up to the second floor, I think. Okay. They so found another button. That's, by the way, that is a button that people only usually find till the end. <laughs> there we go. The blue place is unlocked, and now there is a purple button. Exposed. And he found it. You can now travel upstairs. That thing got thrown to the other side. Um, he has found the pink button over there, which unlocked the, that pink blob he realized that that pink oh wait he realized it up oh, and there goes the, the block falling from below and now you can press the button is over there and this should be unlocked now one little thing i don't think i ever mentioned was i trained both times before to wait for the balloon in there because there's something else happening but this is the only one where it's a, just a distraction. You're supposed to go and do other things and look for stuff while this pops. 
psychological psychological trick, and it pretty much works um, a lot of times because people just wait here for it. You already found this secret area. I said Soret. <laughs> you already found the Soret area. Hey, he found it. Is this castle weird looking? It's a good question. It's probably got some hiding in it because it's weird. Mm hmm. Yeah, just check. I'll try click this chat. Maybe I, I have to click it through the other wall. That's a good point. Because it looks like it's sticking out through that area. Yeah, so I have to hop. I need to climb up. Give up now. <laughs> Give up now. Maybe I have to like click it. What and um, what's the point of a glass window here? <laughs> it's so you Probably can see her. Use... Just have a look in. Just having a look through these gaps. Okay. Do you mind if I try ahead? Yes. It is. Actually, it... what? It is. Just you want a hint? The, yeah, I'll okay. have a hint. It's at the chair. And it's a very precise it's, it's clip. Oh, yeah, it's probably got something to do with the fact that this block is on an I beam. If you want, I can give you another hint because probably, like, maybe the last one. You don't know. Okay, okay, I'll, I'll have. Another hint? Okay. Okay, so. You have to line yourself up with the. It's gonna be on the left side of the wall where you have to press. That's the last hint. I've, I've, I've got. A... Oh, there you go. Okay, now you have to escape. It seems he has found the secret button, and is now ready to go and explore the final area, which is a lever. If he makes this, he wins. Oh, there he goes. He found. He clicked it. Oh, yeah, clock here. Oh. Your time is 16 minutes, 22 seconds, and 0.1 millisecond. I mean, just one millisecond. Congratulations, you, you, you finished the, uh, the escape room. Yeah, I want to wait this. <laughs> nice. Okay, now all I have to do is get up, and this time is done. Congratulations, you have finished the escape room. You may now enjoy your prize of candy, food, and chests. Congrats, you have won. Thank you for doing this. Um, so yeah, his time should be popping up on screen right now. And all that razzmatazz. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video. If you like this, please hit a like. If you wanna see more, please subscribe. Hey friends, family, other people you know, have a nice day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, so you were the last person to do the escape room. We are now going to enter the semifinals. And. Semifinals? Well, not semifinals, no, I don't know. I'll put up the tier list on the screen. Anything you want to yeah. say to the viewers? No. no. Uh, not really. Okay. I... Quack, quack. <laughs> okay, so subscribe to Waddler. He has a pretty new channel. I don't know if you hear about him much. He doesn't have that many subscribers. He only has like past me already. And to me, it's kind of crazy that I've come this far. So while I didn't get to do a sequel to this and while I didn't get to do really much of anything after this, I did enjoy making this in the time I did. I never really got to making another escape room. You probably have seen the rough outline of this, but overall, I kind of just gave up on it. I'm not opposed to doing something like this in the future, but right now I just don't have time, and I'm busy building escape rooms in Minecraft. So have an amazing day, please subscribe, and see you in the next one. And if you made it to this point, uh, <laughs> thanks I guess.